Babes, babes, I'm tired, eh? please. Babes, please now, you just rest a bit, please. Sleep. Babes, please, let me sleep a bit, okay? Please. Sleep, eh? She taught you. Yes, she did. Is there anything else she hasn't taught you since she came? Oh, come on now. Yes, I made it for you. I, I made it for you. But you said you liked it before, you know. Come on now, come on, eat. You're still awake. Where have you been? My visitor's room. I gave the baby a bath, fed him, and then he slept. Yeah. I want you to fire Ada. What? Why? What did she do? you see? Babe, we are growing apart in our own home. We're slowly becoming strangers. This is not how we were. We used to be so sweet together. Now, I don't even know you. You hardly had time for me, babe. I'm dying inside. Babe, I can fire her. She hasn't done anything wrong. I mean, why would I fire her? Are you kidding me? Our marriage is falling apart. And you sit here and you tell me it's not enough reading to sack her. Now you listen to me. Is it that she gets out of this house or I leave this house for both of you? What do you think about this property? Looks good. How much is it? <sighs> I'm trying to get the information. I you showing it to me? That's yes. Because it's in a preferred area. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank, thank you, you so much. Mm. 
Thank you. Is there a problem? Mm -hmm. It's just that I want to travel at the end of the month. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, when are you coming back? Yeah, I mean, is it about pay? I mean, you want an increment? No, sir. I am not coming back. What? You just started working here like t t two months ago. Why the change of heart? Is there a problem? Is it about the pay? I mean, it's about the increment? I am getting married. Ah. Oh. Okay. Oh. Congratulations. Thank you. Well, that's that's good news. Congratulations. Yeah. Just let us know when you're ready to leave. Thank you, sir. Mm. Huh. Wow. I mean, she's a nice girl, but I'm happy for her. It's a good thing. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Why are you calling this now? So who will they cook for us now? No, be person they cook for now before me I carry come. That one happen. Eh? No be poison when that one they cook uh, and say na food before Madame come sack him. Eh? Make Madame cook now. So what now? Make Madame cook. Mask me, come out there. I say you're a comedian. Let go cook. I don't think for this house. For the past six years. I never seen that one boy. Oh, 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 oh. Make madame no hear you. Oh, yeah, no hear you. Oh, no deal. No deal. Let you do that, guys. Let go cook. If you cook, I'll be a match up. Okay. I'll take out the face. I won't cry. All day. Are you sure you're okay? Don't want to go to the doctor? I'll be fine. You should see the doctor, you know. Good morning, sir. Yeah, good morning. No, I'm sorry. Mm. You're all packed? Yes, sir. Right, um, I sent 200,000 to you. Okay? Sir? Thank you very much, sir. It's okay, ah, it's okay, get up. God, we've gone to your eyes, sir. Yeah, 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 Thank get up, you, it's sir. okay. And if you need anything, our door is open, okay? Thank you, sir. Yeah. Well, then, God bless you. Good. Babes? When was the last time you saw your mates? It's two days late. Ah! <laughs> 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 Are you crying because you're going to miss me or my food? I'm not gonna lie. And the reason they put No worry. I go feed you where before I go. Say what now? I go feed you before I go. No worry. My cry one more time. <laughs> you don't do a thing. Um, what was that? 
Good morning. Um, open the gate. Pregnancy test was negative. Negative? Yep. Did you, did you check for Of course I did, yeah. Um, she, she had fever and she missed her, her men. How late is, is it? Two, two days? Two days. Well, it's normal. You should know that um, for them to have fever when the cycle is oncoming, so it's nothing to be perturbed about. I would recommend um, IVF if you guys are that desperate. No, we're, we're not. not. <laughs> we're not. Mm. We're fine. Interesting. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Take care. I'll see you guys soon. It is, yeah? Take care. All right. All right. All right. Laddie, laddie. Oh, ah, yeah. Bah, take. See. So you miss it? Me say they go choo choo. Hi! No worry. I will come and visit you one of these days. Hmm? Mercy. Yes. Chai! Now it's caught you now. Ah, yeah, most of you. No cry again, no. Oh? I may take care. Ha ha ha! I will leave me, Jerry. Oh! Well, I'll go chop the last supper. Daddy, what is this? Daddy, who dropped this baby here? Oh God, I don't know now. Hey, what kind of you picking? you don't say. Hi, what kind of such? And they sleep. Ah, they hear something they crying for my dream. I see this ego be wish. I don't know what's not picking no. Hi. Huh? Women. It be like not picking no. Re oh, really? For the six years he has been staying with you, you have no cause to suspect if foul play. No, he's been a good worker, quite diligent at his duties. Do you have any cause to suspect anyone? How many of your friends will visit you here? Ah. If my Oga and Madame no get friends, no one can get friends. Did you ever leave your post, even for one minute? Say what? Did you ever leave your post, even for one minute? Ha. Ah. Okay, I never leave my post. So. In fact, not the first time while I sleep on duty with this, and I never work. Hmm. Do you have any cause to suspect anyone? Okay, me, I don't know. I just did my own day sleep, JJ. Eh? For my dream, I did hear, wah, wah, did hear cry. I feel not wish you. I don't even know if I'm picking. Who gave you the food you ate? 
So what? Who gave you the food to eat? Marcy now. Marcy is our cook. She just left today. Can you call her? She doesn't have a phone number and besides I don't I don't have a number to call her on. And she works for you? How did you employ her? I put up a notice outside. You have been practically living with a stranger. The next time you need a domestic help, you can contact the agent who can hold responsible if anything happens. Yeah. Mr. Gibson. Yeah. We have gotten all the information we needed. Okay. I assure you we will investigate more in the case. The baby have to stay with you. Stay with me? I mean, if one of the child will have, will have us, we will bear our child. Why would we want a child? We can't keep this child. I am not saying you should keep him forever. Because of the current strike, the child's welfare doesn't have any staff on seats to attend to the situation. But they promise to send over someone here tomorrow. What? A whole day? Yeah, tomorrow. Don't worry. They'll definitely send the staff. Thank you, sir, for your Thank you. Um, um, baby, baby, take. How can you possibly accept to keep a child without considering my opinion? What am I supposed to be the child for a whole day? A whole day, Gary! How are you putting everything on me? I mean, you were here, you didn't say anything. Well, I didn't say anything because I expected you, the man, to know what to do. Well, the police said they would send somebody tomorrow. I don't... You know, this is just... I just don't get it. Like, why couldn't you just tell them to keep the baby until they have a child welfare? I don't understand this. That's my wife. Oh, my God. Somebody left the baby in front of my house. Yes, a baby in the compound. Yeah. That is you know better. Yes, Can I know. Perceive it. I'm call you back. Can you perceive it? Huh? It smells like poo. Exactly. Baby has pooed. So what should we do? Who, who are you asking? What should we do? You're a woman, you know what to do. I mean, what a baby mess up. I don't, okay? And, and, and you, you don't put this on me because I, 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 it wasn't my idea to, 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 to give this baby. Oh, and it was my idea? It was my, it's my responsibility for someone to leave a baby from the house in mysterious way. Okay, just stop. All right? Maybe you need to channel this anger on Latia, not me. The baby pulled. So what now? Are you deaf? I said the baby pulled. Hmm. This boy picking poo. This smells like adult poo. My dad is picking about job. You know if he poo. You know if he poo. Hmm. Very funny. Clean it. So what now? Are you clean it? Huh. My dad never do this kind of thing before. And I said they grew up. They tell me say now woman they take care of picking. Oh. You're very stupid. Sorry, ma. Very, very stupid. Sorry, ma. Hello? Yeah, mom. The baby pooed. And she doesn't know what to do. Yeah, okay. Um, she said you should clean the baby up. Huh? Yeah, he said she cleaned the baby up. What? Who? You! How am I supposed to know? I don't even have the utensils. What am I supposed to do? Why? Okay, you need to stop yelling at me! I'm not yelling, I'm just saying that you... Yeah. Daddy, go, just, just take, 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 take. Go, go and stop this I'll up. come back, oh. Uh -huh. Bye bye, baby. Get out! <laughs> How could a baby... I'm not dealing with this. I'm not. Ooh. 
I'm not giving it to you either. Good afternoon and welcome to Talk Space, where there is no discrimination of any kind and no judgments at all. Whatsoever you say here remains our biggest secret. Okay. So you're welcome. Thank you. Have you been to therapy before? No, this is my first time. Oh. So um, why don't you tell me what the problem is and how you feel about it? Okay. I'm married. My husband is outside, like abroad. Oh. Yeah. So I said to myself, instead of jumping around, I decided to choose someone I'll be rubbing body with. Do not judge me, please. Oh, no judgments at all. Okay. All right. So I met this guy. At first, I didn't fancy him. But when he told me he was married, I decided to give it a try. I did so because we both to be careful and we have something to protect. Okay. But recently, I found out that he's cheating on me with a single lady. I can't stoop so low to be with a man that cheats. Oh, okay. We've been together for three years. He even drives the car my husband bought for me. And he uses it to carry that lady. Please, how can I break up with him without stirring up any quarrel? He took my husband's number from my phone and he might use it to blackmail me. I can't stand the man that cheats. A cheat has been cheated on. Okay. The best advice I can give to you is talk to your husband, come clean to your husband and ask him to forgive you. Because if he finds out you're on your own, this therapy session is over. It's awake. Obviously. Okay, here and here. Yeah. yeah. That's a little big, though. That's big. Well, you could try it though, I mean, no. better than nothing. Okay, can you just sit down and... He can't sit. Oh, uh, oh. He's a baby! Oh, oh, okay. So, how long... You turn him around or something. Yeah. You turn him around when you're hey, trying you to change the diaper. Oh, my... Hey, look at what you're doing. I'm trying. I'm sorry. Hello, Stella. Yeah, you can laugh now, can't you? <clears throat> Take it off now. I'm trying. Just saying. Sorry. Hello, Stella, with the big shit. She is a mess, yes, I admit, I am a mess. Why won't this baby just stop crying? I'm tired. I can't even sleep. Oh, this is all his fault. And he's in his room. Sleeping. Yes, I admit 
I am a mess that makes two of us like two peas in a pod. We fit perfectly. Okay, I need to go in there and make sure. Hey, hey, and make sure the baby stops crying. And I want you to stay there as well. Okay. Next time you you watch your post and not be anyway. I can't turn to baby gets man. Sorry, baby wash man. I'm the same with house. Hey, where are you? Daddy. 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 Hello. Check who's at the gates. Abi Yabo from uh, ah, Child nah, yeah, Welfare. Nah, yeah. Good, day. Ah. Good day, sir. Good day. Mm. You're from Child Welfare? Eh, and I'm here. We've been expecting you. Come. Ah, organ who vex. Who vex? Traffic being there like this. I don't walk, 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 so far. I even climb bike, reach one junction like that, waited there. Traffic still there. I can't get down. Can't they trek again, can't reach here. They can't stop for where I don't stop for this government work. Where they know they pay us well. Eh? Okay, that's fine. The child is inside. Eh. Alright, yeah, please come. Yeah, no. mm. Okay. Come through. Ah, are they picking this? Yes. Yeah. Ha! Ah, 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 ah. Chai. They picking fine, sir. Yeah. Ah, it's ah. Sir, put this more wicked, though. How mama go get mine, eh? To wear this kind of fine picking. Eh? <laughs> he won't stop crying. I, I haven't even slept. Yeah, we haven't slept. Chai. <laughs> Madam, huh? You don't bad this picking. No, we were waiting for you. Ah! Ah! People we get, sir. Ah. Hey! How you go keep picking since yesterday to now? You know, Baba. You won't make it smell. Eh? How you go sleep? How you go sleep, eh? No peace for the wicked, though. Ah. Uh -uh. fact, oh yeah. Take your picking. Me, eh? I don't they go. Uh -uh. If you like, Baba. Hmm? If you like, hmm? No Baba. Mm. Where, where are you going to? The police said you're going to come and take the kid. Eh? Police they pay me, Abi. Or you want make I carry this picking? Go join for the two while I get for house. Oh God, beg I don't they go. Give me transport, make I they go. Oh God, give me transport. Now I use my last money. Take on this place. Are you gonna take the kid? I don't think I the picking go anywhere. Oh God, give me transport now. Seriously? You don't want to give me transport? No, oh. no, She is a mess. Yes. I admit I am a mess That makes two of us Like two peas in a pot We fit perfectly Through all the imperfections He's sleeping now Oh, thank God oh, Such a peaceful child the police are afraid to take my call. They practically tricked you to give me that child. How can that even happen? Even if you wanted to keep the child, due process has to be followed. Uh, please. Uh, go make food for him. I got um, milk on my way back home. Me? Yes, please. Uh, okay. Excuse me. Mm. I told my secretary to reschedule my flight for tomorrow. 
What about your meeting with the carpet company? Oh, I rescheduled my meeting. Mom, how can you advise me to keep a child that's not mine? If we wanted a child, we would have one of ours. Gray, have I ever gone against any of your personal decisions? No. I understand your wife might not want to go through pregnancy, childbirth, and, or any of those. But you need to understand that you need an heir. Mom, how does that even sound to you? Me taking someone else's child as my heir. Your father never knew he was adopted, even years after he married me. What? Um, he never meant anything. His king's men never treated him any different. He enjoyed equal right. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, I, I need help. I, I don't know what temperature, cold water, it's okay. hot it's water. Okay. Yeah. Um, I will need you to get me some clean clothes for him. We, we don't have. No, you two, you have to go shopping for him today. She is a Thank mess. You. Yes, I admit. I am a mess. That makes two of us. Like two peas. Are you okay? Yeah. Why do you ask? You haven't said a word. I was thinking... Maybe we should keep this child. What? Are you kidding? I don't understand. Where's that coming from? We should try to understand. Understand what? I already told you. I am not ready to have a child and nothing will change my mind. But I'm not asking you to have a baby. I'm asking let's keep this one. What? Keep another man's child? I'm not ready to nurse another man's child. We don't know his mother. Do you understand this? Listen, please just understand, okay? Look, even if you want 20 housekeepers, I will get them for you. It's not about that. Okay, please. Help me understand, really. What is so special about this child that you have to keep this one? I just want to feel what fatherhood feels like. Are you with another man's child? Take me home and wrap this child. I am a mess that makes two of us like two peas in a pod. We fit perfectly Ooh. Through all the imperfections Best believe I'll be right here Nobody knows all I love about you Nobody would understand All that I know is I'm in love with you And you are right for me Nobody knows all I love about you. Nobody would understand why. All that I know, I'm in love with you, and you're right for me. See, you were perfect, perfect for me. All right. I'm trying to figure this thing out. There's gas coming out when I turn it on, but it's not sparking up. How do I turn it on? Sir? Do you know how to put on the gas, cook the gas? How, Oga? Oga, all my life. I demand what I do. I don't need to ask a bit. Oh, Lady, that's what I ask you. Do you know how to turn it on or not? Oga, oh, now the same thing with the talk here now. Eh? Oga? Oh, See, it's not in my department, too. This one, a high technology. My department has to have matches. Right. No thanks.
She is a mess. Yes, I admit. I am a mess. That makes two of us. Like two peas in a pod. We feed perfectly. Through all the imperfections, best believe I'll be right here. Nobody knows all I love about you. Nobody would understand. All that I know is I'm in love with you, and you are right for me. Nobody knows all I love about you. Nobody would understand why. All that I know is I'm in love with you, and you are right for me. See you a perfect, perfect for me. I see through your imperfections. You are right for me, baby. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, you are right for me. Who'll be that? Good afternoon. Which you define? Um, sorry, is this Mr. Gary Gibson's house? I'm actually a cook, so I was sent to Mr. Gary Gibson for a job. Say so what now? I said I'm actually a cook. I was sent to Mr. Gary Gibson for a job. Which is how we cook? I can cook everything, trust me. You say we cook banga soup? Mm-hmm. You say we cook egusi soup? Yes. Why soup and afang soup? I can cook everything. Go there. Use the main door. I got the inside. Okay, thank you. Things say cooking now for face and fine shape. We go know. What you cook now? We go know. So how long have you been a cook for? Um, I started cooking at the age of eight, but I studied food and nutrition in school. I can cook both continental and intercontinental dishes so well. Oh, I've got some three people: a cook, a nanny, and a cleaner. Where are the others? Uh, I was only told to come in as a cook. But if you do not mind, I can handle the tree job so well. You can? Yes, I can. Okay. You can start now? Yes, I can. Let me, let me show her. Let me show her. You come. Baby. Mm -hmm. All right, come. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Okay, this is going to be your room. Um, and we'll be upstairs if you need anything, just come upstairs, okay? Okay, sir. Um, Are you sure you can do this job? Of course I can. Can I just start at this place? Yeah. 
Okay. I'll be up the stairs, like I said. Okay. Okay, sir. All right then. Okay, um, sorry about the mess. Um, we've been preoccupied with the baby. Uh, it's okay, sir. Mm. So write a list of what you need, food items, and what you need for the kitchen, okay? Okay, sir. Alright. Okay, um... She is a mess. Yes, I admit. I am a mess that makes two of us like two peas in a pot. We feed perfectly through all the imperfections. Best believe I'll be right here. Nobody knows all I love. Oh, babe. Uh, I think we need to change these cabinets. On all 40 units? Not everything, just the ones that are off-white. Maybe we spent, we spent so much money now. We just it leave needs, it the way it is. No, it, it needs to be perfect and uniform. Uniform, who cares? We're going to sell some and rent some out. It doesn't matter. Baby, it matters. It does. Oh, it's going to cost more. You don't... Okay. Oh. All right. How's the baby? Thank you. Um, he's doing so fine. I've waited and fed him. He's sleeping right now. That's good. Thank you. That's all. All right. Thank, Thank you. you Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Okay. Uh. Looks good. Mmm, this is really delicious. I she can accomplish all this, you know. Accomplish what? You know, cook, go to the market, take care of the kid, all in a short frame of time. Wow. She's only doing her job. Mmm. You know what I think? I think she's extraordinary. This is really good. Baby, aren't you eating anymore? Why? So that nice, huh? Okay. Um, I heard the baby crying. Is everything okay? Oh yes, he's actually very fine now. In fact, I just finished feeding him. Okay. Just came to check on. Okay. All right. Good night, sir. Okay. Baby, please no. It's not good. You've been starving me since now. The worst part is that you're ignoring me. Please stop this. Like you don't know I'm upset with you. What did I do? What did you do? Was it not just yesterday you were raining praises on this maid? You just won't stop. Seriously? Yes, seriously. Okay, baby, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I didn't mean to hurt you. But you I'm, did. I will never do it again, I promise. Okay? Please. Promise. I promise. Can we get a it? Yeah, come in. If you do this, you can be in the very Ah, sorry, Oga. Hey. Good morning, Oga. Good morning. Good morning, madam. Um, just leave in the table, there, okay? Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay then, bye.
Was that my pyjamas? Yes. It was your old one. I gave it to her that she could wear it. You don't wear it anymore, so I thought if she wears it, it would be baby. Please don't go. Baby, please now. Baby, what about me? We just made up. Hi. Me and my mouth, my eyes. <laughs> I mean, the first time was terrible. He just cried all night. Nobody could sleep. Oh my God. And then the welfare officer came the next day with her own bag of trouble. I mean, she cursed us out for not showering the babe or oh. feeding the babe. But honestly, that's so terrible. Mm -hmm. Because babies do not really need so much. If you give them what they want, trust me. They're good to go. Well, we didn't know that at that time. I mean, how could we know? But your wife should have some little experience as a woman. Well, we didn't plan to have children, so what was the point? Wow. I'm actually so surprised hearing this. In Africa, like, it's, it's very unusual. Well, thank God you're hearing it from the horse's mouth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. It's so well spoken, though. Oh, thank you very much, Sam. Good morning, Ada. Oh, good morning, sir. How was your night? My night was fine. Okay, and the baby? The baby is doing great. That's good. He's actually sleeping. Okay, that's good. So what are we having for breakfast? Um, scrambled egg with oatmeal and bread. Sounds tasty. Yeah. Can you teach me how to make that? Sure, I can. But so I will just allow you to do it yourself. Then I can just guide you. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> See you a perfect. Perfect for me I see through your imperfections uh, You are right for me Baby Oh Oh You know, I was wondering, how do you find time to do all the chores and then still have time for yourself and the baby? It's actually a feminine DNA. You know, I actually learned how to multitask from small, so I'm kind of like used to it already. Wow. It's not hard. Mm. You know, I wonder what it would be like having kids, you know, running around. Trust me, kids are a wonderful experience. So I just think you should try it. You love them, believe me. Okay. You like? Oh, great. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> You're right. I did. Mm -hmm. Serious. Mm -hmm. And I taught me. She seems to be teaching you a lot of things. Yeah, I mean, she is extraordinary, you know. I'm so sorry. I want to call the welfare officer. I want us to adopt a kid. Why are you telling me? 
You seem to clearly have it all figured out and your mind made up. So why the hell are you telling me? Good afternoon and welcome to Talk Space, where there is no discrimination of any kind and no judgments at all. Whatsoever you say here remains our deepest secret, so you're welcome. Thank you. So, have you been to therapy before? Not at all. This is actually my first time. And I need your help. Okay, I'm here to listen. I'm not proud of what I did. My boyfriend and I were making out, and he passed out. Oh, well, the right thing is to take him to the hospital. Did you take him to the hospital? I did. I okay. took him to the hospital. Okay. But something happened. What? The unfortunate thing is, my husband is a doctor, and he's the one attending to him. And something else. He's in coma. So I don't know what to do. Oh no. Ah, ah. Tipiki don't be pass as I see him before. Uh, yes. Chai. He actually had appetite since I started giving him multi bites. <laughs> I like Ooh. that one. Hey, I like calm. See how to be keen, fine. Ah, think sweet me for body. Try. Hey, Oga. As I've been telling you before, eh, you see this strike. Hmm? And because with this strike like this, eh, that eh, adoption, this, I don't feel run up. No, no, you don't feel run up again. See, strike finish. Hmm? Oh, no worry yourself. No worry yourself at all. Me, I know person will be my own. Hmm? And you always know. Hmm? Okay, just do all you can, okay? Ah, don't worry yourself. I could, I could, I could do something. Yeah? Okay. I want to go. All right, thank you. Ah. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> um, <laughs> God. Yes. This one looks too much. No, no, no. Ah. Hey, Google bless you. Try. Eh? Ah, thank you. See, eh? For this matter, like this, this, this baby matter. Come over to you. I go run now for you. Me, mm. in my full chest. Don't worry. Thank Don't you. worry. I go run now. Wait, wait. Hi. Um, madam, I was actually wondering <laughs> if I'm taking for immunization. No carry and go you. No bother yourself at all, eh? No bother. Me, I will carry my two legs. Come here. Come run out for you. Okay. Don't hear me. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Ah, Oga, God bless you. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Thank you. Ah! Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh. I'm sad to leave, Sam. Yeah, um, listen, I'm really sorry, huh? I will send you some money. And hopefully that should help you for a bit. Okay, I'll just send you some money, okay? Thank you very much, sir. You're welcome. One millionaire. Yeah. No, no, it's okay. Sir, hey. God bless you, sir. It's okay. Oh it's my okay. God, sir, this is just too much for me. It's all right. You can get up, get up. It's okay. Sir, thank you so it's much. It's okay. And listen, if you need anything, just let me know, okay? <sighs> sir, may God bless it's you. Okay. I'm, I'm really so grateful. Okay. Sir, may God okay. bless you it's so okay. much. And if you need anything, please don't hesitate to call me, okay? <sighs> sir, may God bless you. I'm, sir, I'm grateful. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you so much. It's, right. it's just too much. It's all right. You take care of yourself, okay? <sighs> Thank you, sir. All right. Bye now. Shh. 
She is a mess. Yes, I admit. I am a mess. That makes two of us. Like two peas in a pod. We feed perfectly. Through our. Oh. You're back. Yeah. How come you use so many diapers? He won't stop pooing. Not normal, I mean, are you sure the child is okay? Well, if you could talk, you would have told us if he's okay. You know, maybe we should take him to see the doctor or probably call that well for a woman. Ah, uh, listen, uh, whatever you decide to do, please. I've had a very stressful day and I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, but... Okay. Hey, little one. You can take him. I think he's happy where he is. So you're traveling this morning with your bags packed and you're only telling us now? See, I guess it be like this, eh? Even me. I don't know say I go travel this morning. I don't know. So when are you coming back? Oga, I no go lie you. I don't know. Ah, Oga. See now, Oga cause this thing. Oh, eh? For this, I say no food to chop. Eh, up on that, they go see they give person eh, 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 clothes to work to wash one person shit. Oh, Oga, I no do it again, no. Oh. Lade, Lade. Madam. You are mad. Say what now? You are mad. So you and your girlfriend brought that illegitimate child to this house. And now you want to run off. You want to abandon your child and your duties. You're a thief. I'm calling the police. Ah, uh, 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 madam. <laughs> madam. So, madam, so you know they watch comedy. <laughs> you never used like that now. Hey, hey, madam. So you, you, you mean you know they watch Instagram. So you, you, know, you know they watch prank. You see, now prank, I know they go away. You are pranking. Are you, have you lost your, I, don't we pay you enough salary? The audacity. Can get I, out of this place. Madam, I'm going to go again. Get out of this place. Madam, I'm going to go again. Get out of this place. Which tweets? Now these shouting, they make me one pack, self. I can't imagine it's not true. Let's see, we just did it. They shout at me. I'm not picking. Get I think we're paying too much. I will head. Good morning. Um, welcome to Talk Space, where there is no discrimination of any sort and no judgment at all. Whatsoever you say here remains our deepest secret. So you're welcome. Thank you. Um, have you been to therapy before? It's our first time. Oh. And hopefully it will be our last. No, I don't want to be here. You're the one forcing me. When you don't listen, when I say anything. What thing do you tell me? What stinking thing do you tell me? What stinking point are you talking about? The point that you, the point here is that you are selfish. And utterly disrespectful. You don't realize that there are responsibilities attached to that title, wife. What you fail to realize is that you are selfish. You are disrespectful. Who use are you? Look at you. Simply because I brought myself down to assist at home. Because I work at home. To help out. We short. Suddenly, that's where the contempt, the CFD is crept in. Suddenly, so she's now the one who wears the trouser. Or oh, then, then she got a raise at, at work. Started, started, earning, started earning seven figures. Oh, since then, she's standing here as I'm talking to you. I am no longer worthless in my house. She packs up clothes for me to wash, leaves, leaves dishes, 
and everything is office now. Is she, she's either in the office or she's in the traffic or she's with her boss. That's all I keep hearing in my mind. That's all I keep hearing. What am I supposed to do? What kind of marriage is that? And then you come at home at 2 a.m. and then slam onto the bed. Not even asking if your husband needs anything. Not even asking if your husband is hungry. You, you, you don't address yourself to my needs. Look at you. Look at you. You're not even attractive. Look at, look at you, 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 you. You're shapeless. You don't, you, you're not sexy. I told you, since God didn't give you beautiful shape, go and get it from a doctor. No, you argue. I am a man. I need something to hold on to. I need something succulent to hold on to, to suck on. You won't listen. You argue. Eh? I, 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 are you not supposed to be my wife? Eh? Am I a single man? Wife or slave. So, Mel, do you have anything to say? I sure do have something to say. As the old saying goes, who did you face? You did pay. This man here, I go to work, I get back, I fix his food before he's back from work. I wear sexy lingeries for him. I do everything to please this man. I up my sex game in everything. I, what have I not done to make my marriage work? He, everything about me is disgusting. If it's not my finger, if it's not the food I made, if it's not my... He always complains about everything. If I ask him for common money to buy little things, he doesn't have money for me. I am so broke, I should go fix my bills myself. Yeah, you know what I did? I took his advice. No problem. You know what I did? I didn't just end the promotion that gave me the seven figures like he said. I didn't gain it like that. I worked hard for it. You know how hard I worked for it? I worked so hard by spreading my legs for my boss. He was banging me so good. He is so good because he knows my words. He knows. He knows. He loves my perfections and imperfections. He loves everything about me. What he did not value in me, he valued everything in me. And you want to tell me about you being being a man who cares right now? No, your care is too late for me. I don't want it. You know what? This boss has been so good to me that he banged me so hard. So know that I'm no peace. And right now, as I'm talking to you, I am not just spreading for my boss. I am pregnant. And it's not for you, it's definitely for my boss. Fuck out on me. Gary, I'm talking to you. Are you really just... Gary, listen, there's no way Ada is coming back to, to this house. If you did bring her into this house, I would, I would just... Oh, what, what? You, 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 what? Huh? I'm sick and tired of living in my own house like a refugee. I have money yet I can't feed. If she's coming back to this house, whether you like it or not, I'll bring her back no matter what. Do what you want to do. She is a mess. Yes. You bring her back to this house I and you see what I I am a mess that makes two of us. She doesn't cook, she doesn't clean, she doesn't wash. The wash doesn't take care of the baby. It's like you didn't know I don't do those things before you're married. And what baby are you talking about? The one that's illegally out? We agreed of not having any kids. Well, I changed my mind. I want that baby. Oh, really? Then deal with the responsibilities. Well, you Why mean, do I have to deal with them? I don't want kids. You don't, you're not even taking care of the kid. Someone else is taking care of the kid. Why are you complaining? What is... It's okay, it's okay. That's all right. Mr. Gary. Please, can you give me a moment with her? Alone. He spends all his time with her. I mean, who spends so much time with his staff to the extent that she has taught him how to cook? Are you listening to yourself? Yes. It's, it's absurd, right? Someone does all the chores in the house and still has time to take care of your husband. Doesn't that tell you that you failed in this marriage? What? I have two kids. I've never sorted a help of a maid. You better get yourself up and make your marriage work. Because if you divorce this man, what makes you think you can last a week with any other man? So you want a divorce too? She's the one asking for it. 
I see no reason why I shouldn't give it to her. You still love her? Of course I still love my wife. I never stopped loving her. You know, women are like babies. We express our emotions by either crying or smiling. I think she's just jealous. Jealous of what? She doesn't have to be sure before being jealous. Let me just say this to you, Mr. Gary. Being happy doesn't mean that everything is perfect. It means that you have chosen to look beyond imperfections. Well, I'm really confused. I don't know if this marriage was a mistake. Bro, I have to tell you this. No marriage is a bed of roses. I wanted to also know that love is not all it takes to sustain a marriage. Remember when I used to come to your neighborhood every Saturday? Remember? Yeah, sure I do. Okay, would you be interested to know why I was coming there always? I was coming for a cooking lesson. Yes. My wife was a horrible cook. When I got tired of eating horrible meals, what did I do? I had to create time out of my very busy schedule to come and learn how to cook. And it, it worked. You see, my marriage is not perfect. It was never perfect. We had issues. I was abusing my wife. And now she is pregnant for her boss. Yes. <laughs> Listen, all I'm trying to let you know is that you can, it is never too late to rebuild your marriage. You're not serious. I know it sounds that way, but it's the truth. You can partner with your wife on domestic shores. What does it take? Accept her imperfections. Support her through her weaknesses without necessarily rubbing it on her face. And you are shocked at how strong that the both of you will grow together in love. There is no there's no mirror, there's no magic to it. Oh Juju. Honestly, I'm begging you do not make the mistake I made. Don't. You will regret it. Soda. Ah, yeah. Give me one. Oh, no, 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 no. Ben, no. I have just two. And you know I need it for my contraceptive, so no. Come on, I'll buy you. I'll buy you. I'll buy you. I'll buy you. I'll replace it. No, babe. No, I have one. Don't be vexed and they buy a whole truckload of it, you know. Oh, gosh. She is a mess. Yes, I admit I am a mess That makes two of us Like two peas in a pot We fit perfectly Through all the imperfections Best believe I'll be right here Nobody knows all I love about you Nobody would understand All that I know is I'm in love with you And you are right for me 
Nobody knows all I love about you. Nobody would understand why. All that I know, I'm in love with you, and you're right for me. See, you were perfect, perfect for me. I see through your imperfections. Uh, you are right for me, baby. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Yes, you are right for me. She is a mess. Yes, I admit. I am a mess that makes two of us like two peas in a pod. We fit perfectly. Hey. Hey. Um, I made us lunch. Babe, hold on. Come on. I'm sorry. Sorry for everything I made you go through. And I'm sorry too. I'm sorry for allowing a stranger to come between us. Nobody's anybody's fool. Nobody is anybody's fool. And I love the perfect imperfection. Now, how about you come and try my new concussion? There you go. This is actually a special recipe that mm -hmm. I actually mixed up. Everything. Like two peas in a pot, we feed perfectly through all the imperfections. Best believe I'll be right here. Nobody knows all I love about you. Nobody would understand All that I know is I'm in love with you And you are right for me Nobody knows all I love about you Nobody would understand why All that I know is I'm in love with you And you are right for me See you were burned. 